So what about columns, buttons, or YouTube videos? Well, we've built a component to take care of all of that in one package. Uh, they're called widgets. So let's head to our training page again and make sure that we have it checked out. And that's all ready to edit. So what we're going to want to do is pr place the cursor where we want our layout to happen. And the toolbar appears, and we're going to click this widget icon here. Uh, you'll see a couple of options here, but let's get started with the UWGB2 column widget. We're met with a pop-up window that asks us what we want to place in the widget. The first dropdown asks how large we want the two columns. Do we want the first column to be smaller than the second? I'll keep them 50-50 for now. So the text inputs here ask us what we're looking for. You can see that this header here says column one. So it's asking what we were looking for in just the first column. Let's find an image by hitting select and going to the media library. Let's be sure to give it some alternative text for screen readers and accessibility. The media URL and media height is for YouTube videos, so let's just leave that one blank for now, and next is the header text. So you just want to fill that in with whatever header you want. We're going to enter a size, and I think an H4 might be appropriate. And this is where we enter paragraph text. It'll describe anything that you want. Finally, we have the buttons, and this is a clickable graphic that you might have seen around the uwgb.edu website. Uh, we fill in whatever we want the button to say and where we want it to link it to. Uh, so for this example, let's do RSVP now and link it to forms.google.com. Here we can change the color and let's make it a green. So that was our first column, and let's just quickly make another second column for an example of what it'll ultimately look like. So we're going to select another image. Fill out the alternative text. Give it a nice header. Change the size. Paragraph text. More RSVP. The same hyperlink that we want to see to go to. And let's make this one a dark gray. So let's hit save and close, and you'll see the small little gear icon now on the page. And it might not look like much, but if we click Save and Preview, ta-da! We have a two-column layout with all the information that we've entered, and it's also fully responsive, meaning it'll look great on any device. So let's try adding a YouTube video. Uh, if we head back to the edit mode and bring up UWGB's YouTube page, select a video, and what we're going to want to do here is click the share icon and the embed link. Uh, what we're specifically looking for is, do you see this little iframe? This is the link that makes it work. So we're going to want to grab that iframe link and 
head back to our Keneco editor. And what we're going to want to do is add another YouTube or another column widget. So for this example, maybe let's do a one column. And what it's going to do is ask us how big we want it. Uh, for this example, let's go full width. And we'll enter in the media URL. And that was, again, just this iframe link that we got from the share link. Uh, now we'll need to enter a height, and this is kind of a little bit of a guessing check. Uh, let's try 200 pixel. Let's hit save and close. Save and then preview. Well, our YouTube video is there, but it's a little, it's a little short. Uh, so let's head back into edit view, and now we make modifications to widgets is we just double click on them and what we're going to want to do here is maybe try 550 save preview that looks much better the media url can be anything that's an iframe so Qualtrics, Google Forms, Flickr galleries, it can really open the options up on your web page. Uh, if you ever have any questions on widgets or embeds, please let us know in the web dev inbox. Uh, or there's the UWGV knowledge base on the IT website that has information more on iframes, embeds, and the other options. But for now, uh, let's try out the other Keneco application Media libraries, and you'll be all set to edit website.